six swing essentials, whatever the weather. Number two, grip. So if you saw my first six essentials video, you'll know that we're trying to keep as many natural elements of your posture as possible. With the grip position, it's very similar. And if you didn't see my first video, where were you? Go back and watch it. So what I mean by natural hand position is from a good posture, if you allow the hands to hang, that's pretty much how they should sit on the grip. So let's go through this step by step. So step one, I'm going to explain this for the right hand golfer, so you lefties, just think the other way around. So step one, we're trying to get the hands on the club in their natural position. Natural position is not parallel, natural position is turned in, so the left hand sits in its natural turned in position on the club. That means that we're gripping in the fingers of the club, the ball of the hand sits on top, there is no contact in the palm of the hand, that's why some people wear a glove on this hand, and the thumb just rests on the club there. So we're in a natural position of the top hand. The second step of your top hand position, as taught to be by my coach, the great Jean-Jacques Rivet, is to feel up at the top of the swing if you were to let go with your right hand, you'd be in a position to be able to powerfully throw that golf club down and through towards your target. From an unnatural position or weak position parallel to the body, you don't get the same feeling of strength from here. With a stronger position, natural position, or as many of the top players do, even more on top of the club, you get a very strong sensation of throwing that club down and through towards your target. Right hand position, slightly different to the left hand position. Left hand is coming on top in its natural position, right hand comes a little more from the side because the left thumb is in the way, so the right hand to get comfortable fit between the fold of your right hand and the thumb needs to sit more on the side. And we're trying to get good leverage from the right arm, elbow and wrist into strike. And if the right hand is too much on top of the club, these levers don't work in a powerful way. So the right hand a little more on the side of the club than the left hand is. very briefly about linkage. Baseball or ten finger grip, overlap grip or interlock grip. Doesn't really matter if we've paid attention to the first phase getting the hands in their natural position and we pay attention to the next phase grip pressure. So experiment with these three. Personally I'm not a great lover of baseball grip but I've seen it work so experiment with these three. We're just trying to find a comfortable natural position. <laughs> Grip pressure. We don't want this to be a white knuckle ride. I've talked about this in earlier videos. Go and watch them. But on a very basic level, think of a scale. One to five. One, two loose. Five, as tight as possible. We want to be about number three. And almost more important than what it actually is, keep it the same from start to finish. Go watch my other videos. Six Swing Essentials video number three coming very soon. Oh, put that kettle on my Agnes. Please the boss of a brass monkey out here. Mm.